Now, when I and Senator Keeley here founded the Coalition for Moral Order, this it was to express moral rather than political views. Oh, I, I think what Senator Jackson is trying to say is that morality is political. Abortion, same-sex marriage, and the like. It's a wonderful show. It's the most intelligent show on television. It would not exist if politicians didn't make laws to protect them. That's why both houses are now Republican. Oh, now, now you've gone... Bravo, it's the perfect platform. Yes. I'm so glad I got on Jackson's bandwagon instead of Dole. Dole is just too, too... Uh, dark. Well, I was going to say liberal, but he's dark, too. Oh, i got to fire this woman. You know, this young man that Barbie wants to marry... Uh, Miss Porter, uh, page two, second paragraph. It's porno, not pronto. I, I wonder if he's old money. I mean, a cultural attaché. Your campaign manager is calling. He says he's got to talk to you. Thank you, Bridget. Hello, Ben. Ready for what? What? What's the matter, Kevin? Jackson's dead. Oh, my God. He died in bed? Whose bed? A prostitute? No. A minor? And black? What? I don't believe this. I don't fucking believe this. I'm ruined. No, you're not responsible. Kevin, you cannot be held responsible for Senator Jackson's private life. Louise, I'm the vice president of the Coalition for Moral Order. My co-founder has just died in the bed of an underage black whore. Now, wait till the media gets a hold of this. Bridget! I could really use some candy. Here, you want one of these? Oh, this was smiling, so I didn't worry. How do they get them on so quickly? They pay. They're not mentioning you much. It's early. Senator Jackson's last words tonight on Inside Edition. Uh, have you got to get a shot of the house from back here? Okay, I don't know if we're going to make the live shot. If we have to, I'll just do stand up. He looked kind of funny. Yeah, we're here. But he was smiling, so I didn't worry. After the rest of the world. Uh, yeah, we got a good spot. Have you nope. seen anything? I don't know whether he's going to. Excuse me. Why don't you go ahead and set up there? Figure you're going to get part of the house and me down my chest. I don't know whether he's going to come out. But... Where's Dad? Oh, he snuck out this morning to meet with his advisors. They refused to come here. Mom? Oh, I never should have let him go. How will he get back in? Mom? Hmm? Mom, I, I have something to tell you about Val's parents. Oh, they can't blame us for this. Eli Jackson is a common redneck. We had nothing to do with him socially. They can understand that, can't they? Mm-hmm. Well, thank goodness they're not snobs. Oh! the orchard over the top of the barn oh it's so dangerous you could have fallen i did oh i'm just a wreck this thing is all anybody can talk about oh. kevin mm. if we can manage it there may be a solution what death didn't work for jackson what about a wedding a big white wedding what do you mean what wedding who's getting married no no why not it would restore your image a wedding is hope, and a white wedding is family and morality and tradition, and it would be such a special marriage. I mean, the son of a, a cultural attaché, a, a sort of a diplomat, really, who doesn't look down on us because of Senator Jackson, who's willing to join our family. There's the cover of People and Time and Newsweek right there. Love and optimism versus cynicism and sex. It would be an affirmation. If necessary, we'll get the Pope's blessing. It's not hard. No, I don't know. He's too controversial. Well, uh, Billy Graham. No, he's too liberal. Where's the candy? You've had enough candy. This boy, what's his father's name? Armand? Coleman? Really? Well, I wonder if they're related to Tish and Bobo Coleman. Are they from Boston? I don't think so. Well, I think we should go down to South Beach immediately. We should have dinner... You should have dinner with them and spend the night with the Bushes. Mr. and Mrs. Armin Coleman of Greece and South Beach. Been a lot of tasteless jokes going around about the death of Senator Eli Jackson. 
And here's another one. Join Jay on The Tonight Show with his guests Yasser Arafat and Kate Moss. This is unbearable. Kevin, no! Shush! I'm just going down the ladder. I can't face the press tonight. Tell the chauffeur to come around. Pick me up outside the orchard. No, you can't do that. I don't want to go out there alone. You won't be alone. Barbara will be with you. It's not you they're after, Louise. <gasps> Daddy! Shush! I'm just going down the back way. Yeah, but I thought we decided that you were going to announce Barbara's wedding to the Coleman boy. Well, not before we meet them. What if they change their mind? Well, let go of my coat. I'll meet you in the car. I don't know about this. Yes, it is. Senator, Senator Keeley. Keeley. He does Senator now Keeley. his house. Uh, Senator, Senator Keeley. Keeley. Senator Keeley, do you think this will cost you both? Senator, Senator, what's the future of the coalition for more oil than now? Senator, what about the rumors that Senator Jackson was Senator, what about the Gentlemen and ladies, I am, as are all my colleagues, Republican and Democrat, liberal and conservative alike, uh, stunned and saddened by the circumstances surrounding the death of Senator Jackson, uh, as well as the death itself. Uh, but Senator, uh, could we... My family and I are leaving town for a few days uh, uh, for reasons that I, I, I cannot... Uh, to, um, to plan an event. Uh, what do you mean? An event which uh, I uh, cannot... Uh, <laughs> which may perhaps heal some of the uh, bad... Uh, things that uh, Senator Jackson's demise has made us all feel. Where are you and your family going, Senator Keeley? Where? Uh, to our farm. And uh, that's all I'm going to say at this time. Did you know the girl, Senator? Senator, Senator what's the future of the coalition for more order now? Please, let's charter a plane. No. Can't get out of the car. The second we get out of the car, we'll be spotted. A few today said that Senator Jackson's last words, your money's on the dresser, chocolate, were racist and demeaning. The prostitute's given name was Natum Bundra, and she is... That idiot, Jackson. Now the blacks will start. Barbara's wedding will disassociate us from all this, really. I mean, the Colemans are a perfect family. They've never even been divorced, have they, Barbara? No. See? We're on our way to salvation. 